Hello and welcome to the second video sh of uh, me showing off the Strike Fighters 2 Europe Expansion Pack 2. And there's one particular little feature I know that many have been very, very eager to get their hands on. So, without further ado, I'm gonna choose Skyhawk, go for Anti-Ship, and then enter the Mission Editor. The Mission Editor looks like this. It's a map of the current battle area. And we now see here that the enemy wishes to impede my march with a couple of fish beds. Let's just delete them. And they also have a number of MiG-15s wanting to go into the area. Oh, nasty things that. Uh, but I think I will delete those as well. Because what I'm gonna show you, I want to do it undisturbed. Here is my starting flight. As you can see, it's two uh, A4E Skyhawks armed for an anti-ship mission. Here are the ships. Now cargo ships. How many times haven't we blown up cargo ships? Well, no longer. Here we have a long list of ships we can blow up. As you can see, it's everything from the carriers to the destroyers and patrol boats. So, I think we're gonna actually put in a small convoy of destroyers here. These are going to be our primary targets. Now, as you can see, we can also choose the waypoint of these destroyers. They'll be heading for Putznik and uh, out from outside Pinemünde. Now, I'm gonna add a new object right here at the mouth of the bay. This is going to be our intercept cruiser. It's going to be a carrier. Now, we put on a little skill level there, and we're also going to add a small task force accompanying said destroyer. Uh, we're going to zoom in real tight here and give ourselves a dis single destroyer. Uh, and we're also going to be a little bit mean. We're going to have the enemy destroyer actually passing close by the carrier group here. This has now created a uh, little setting for us to toy around with. Now we're going to add a waypoint here for the destroyer. That's simply going to head straight for the enemy destroyers. Whatever there have been in the combat, I don't really think so, because our duty will be to sink the enemy destroyers before they sink our ships. Now, here's the home base, and we simply select G2 in the area, and we will be launching from the carrier. And same thing with end base. Now we're going to choose some of the overused waypoints, uh, since we actually do not need them. And we have a little bit of too many waypoints already. So we're gonna destroy those. And now we have an aircraft that simply will take off from the carrier and then return to the carrier to destroy this threat to the battle group. Uh, now we're simply going to zoom in a little bit more and create a new flight. This flight will also launch from the carrier. Oh, sorry, I had the Super Saber selected. This is one good thing to, to notice. Uh, if you're choosing an aircraft that can't be launched from a carrier, you can't place it on a carrier. I'm a little bit disappointed at that, but we're going to have a Sky Raider or two in the region. And they're going to be launching from the carrier and land at the carrier. Uh, these ones will have an anti-ship loadout and they, they will have the same target as us. Their mission will be anti-ship anti and their targets the same as us. Now they don't really have any waypoints uh, aside from these ones. So we're gonna give them a couple. Right, that's it. Now let's see how this actually ends up. This is the first time I've been using the mission editor, well, second time since I did a, f a failed video before this. And we're gonna, just gonna check our ornaments and they're all good. So, see you in the mission. All right, so we are on the deck of a carrier and this is our flight. And I really can't see the um, other flight, Rambler flight. Uh, but we can see other flights in the region, most of them ha which hasn't been joined by me. This is what was supposed to be my escort group in the original mission. And I must admit that 
And here are the sky radius I added. They're already close over the target area. But we're gonna launch and see for ourselves what's over there. As you can see, the carrier is placed in the mouth of the bay, just where I placed it. And here are the target. A destroyer. Well, actually, it's four destroyers. And all of them are ours to engage. I don't really know what the summer has for weapons, but I actually think that was a flak debris exploding close to me, but if it was not, then I don't really know where the fuck that came from. So, we're moving in. Bombs. This is going to be rather interesting, actually. Uh, I have to note that carriers can, as of yet, not be destroyed. I want to emphasize not since uh, their flight decks still make them invulnerable to attack. This is due to crash mechanics, as I understood it, and we have to wait until the Tomcat title in order to have real naval combat, according to Third Wire. Now, uh, my bombing attack wasn't really that good, and the escort flight has met up with us, and, well, let's try it again then. Can't have these destroyers going the whole ape shit on our carrier group. Whoa! That was really bad by me. I went too close with the bombs and was hit by the debris. Well, at least now you know how the mission editor looks. Uh, and in case your carrier group, all you brave servicemen and women out there, in case it gets hit by a couple of destroyers, just blame me. Thanks for, thanks for listening. I'm out.